Founded in 1888. That's right. Ladies and gentlemen, today we are in Fillmore, California for the annual 4th of July car show, chili cook-off, and train rides. Now, the car show portion is massive. There is no possible way that I could cover every single amazing car here. So I'm just gonna pick a few of my favorites. Let's begin with this guy. Not only is that an amazing engine build, but man, the attention to detail, and it's so clean. Check out the size of these tires. Those are some wide slicks. I don't even want to know the amount of effort that went into this paint job. Look at the way those flakes glimmer in the sun. I'm a big fan of the Myers mix. It's such an icon of the era. And this one is, wow, mint condition. That is a nice rear end. And just to the right of it, it looks like we have a Cobra. These things are as fun to drive as they are to look at. Everything about this car is beautiful. This was another favorite of mine. I'm a big fan of Suicide Doors and this car has them. Not all the cars here are life-size. The Burning Rubber Toy Company has this amazing truck full of scale and toy cars. Those are the oldies that make you go get that first tattoo, baby. I'll give you all 10 of them right now for 25 bucks. Here's one of my favorites. I built a time machine out of a DeLorean. Yo, Dom, what's the buster doing here? The buster kept me out of handcuffs. I have an oldies flash drive. I have an old school flash drive. If you're searching for a rare, hard to find toy car, it's probably here. There's a strange place in my heart for vans. And this one is just so unique with its tiki themed interior. I had to take a closer look. If you get hungry or thirsty, there are plenty of restaurants to take a break at while you look out onto the street and the beautiful cars in front of you. Here's just one of the many DJs spinning the hits for your enjoyment. Because of YouTube copyright reasons, I can't let you hear that. 
another one of my favorites. It's a little bit loud, yet subdued at the same time. You can literally spend all day here. Check out the headlights on this car. That is so cool. You gotta love those futuristic interiors. Even the vinyl seats have a metallic sheen to them. It's like straight out of the Jetsons here. There's more to this day than just a car show. There's also live music. And a beer garden. What's this? There's a chili cook-off too? Count me in. This cook-off is officially sanctioned. Serious business here. There are plenty of chili booths for you to sample and enjoy. Out the judging area. All right, what, what, who, who's gonna win? Do you want to decide? You want to help decide? Sign up for the two, um, oh. judging cheese. Really? That's right. I'm officially in on judging this competition. Everything's getting set up now, and the judges are preparing, going over rules and regulations. I'm ready, ballot in hand. Well, I was informed by the head judge that I cannot vlog judging, so I apologize for that, but it's still interesting to be a part of this process. You know, a lot of these cooks spend a lot of time and a lot of money preparing this chili. And there's a lot at stake too. From here, they can go on to the final rounds and win up to $25,000. So I'll be doing my best as a judge and uh, we'll see what happens. The results of the competition will be available soon on their website. Okay, switching tracks now. How about something totally different? An antique mall inside of a train. Oh, I gotta go inside and check this out. This is so cool. Whether you like antique browsing or not, you have to admit, the novelty of having an antique shop inside of old train cars, I mean, come on, where, where else in the world do you get stuff like this? Ooh, toy cars. No, no DeLoreans. What is this? A vintage Candyland game? What? The price is right too, four dollars. But if antique shopping is not your thing, how about getting your portrait taken on a railroad track 
to use as your tender profile pic. That's actually not a bad idea. Hey girl. Check out that caboose. I wonder what kind of mischief I can get into up there. I present to you the full release lever. I was wondering where that was located. And if you're serious about trains, why not take a ride on one? You can ride the rails in Fillmore, California. It's a nice view from a distance, but how about an up-close and personal look? Well, the day is coming to an end. The car show is officially over. And last call was announced at the beer garden. Likewise, it's about time that we wrap up today's vlog. I sincerely thank you for watching. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to my channel, it's free. You can choose to get notifications so you don't miss out when I release new episodes. And it gives you a chance to participate in the comment section. Thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did.